Hello, pretty people. Welcome back to Simply Delish Duo. Today, we are going to show you how to make these super delicious caprese salad bites. You guys, aren't these the cutest thing? Let me just hold one up to the camera here. Oh my gosh, aren't they just absolutely cute? You guys, what a way to impress your guests. These make a perfect appetizer or even a salad, and in a matter of minutes. Beautiful, fresh ingredients. A great presentation for your great guests. Great presentation. So mm -hmm. honestly, if you want to impress, make these. So if you're new to our channel, check out our other videos, and don't forget to subscribe. All right, now before we run down with the list of ingredients and measurements and everything, I we want to talk about the vinegar. Now Chica will take over. We did use a cup of uh, balsamic vinegar and Chica will take over with the, ingredients, so the instructions. With, yeah, with the balsamic vinegar, you need to make a balsamic vinegar reduction, which means you need to cook your vinegar. So we used a full cup, it sounds like a lot, but when it cooks down, when it cooks, it comes down to nothing basically yes. and you want it to be like a I don't know if you can see here a thick syrupy consi consistency so this is what you want because we're going to spread this all over our um, our salad here and I like to do this ahead of time because you want it to cool down you don't want to put this hot reduction no, with the over mozzarella the cheese yeah mozzarella and the and the fresh uh, vegetables here so next what you will need is Toothpicks. We start off with a cherry tomato. I don't know if you can see this here. So just place a cherry tomato on your toothpick. Fresh mozzarella? Not yet. Oh, the basil. Oh the my basil. gosh. Okay, really, how did I forget the basil? I have my most favorite plant right beside me. My basil plant, you guys, it's almost as tall as I am. It's Isn't a that nice, that? healthy looking. Oh, and it's beautiful. I love this plant. And it smells yeah. so nice, so nice. Very important, you need to use fresh basil. Won't taste good without fresh Not basil. And a leaf, so I take a leaf and I kind of fold it in half, or depending how big it is, in quarters. And it goes right after the tomato. And then lastly, you are going to take a, I don't know if it's you can see. The fresh mozzarella. Here. Fresh mozzarella and just place it on your toothpick here. We use the Bocconcini pearls. Yeah, they're the pearls, yeah, which are the, the pearls small ones. They're the tiny ones. They're the really tiny ones, so it's perfect. So, uh, doesn't this look absolutely delicious and, and it, cute? And it makes a great presentation. It like does. You're having guests over for dinner. A nice perfect. appetizer. Absolutely. So what we'll do is, we will continue assembling our, our um, baby skewers, baby skewers, and we'll come back to show you what they look like, and then we'll run down the rest of the ingredients that we will need. So we just finished assembling all our skewers here. Don't they look pretty? I know, aren't they absolutely cute? And if you want, actually, you can use a bigger skewer, the longer skewers, and have more than just one. Yeah, you, you can, can double them. Yeah, you can double them. But we like to keep things really cute. Looking. I gotta move my beautiful baby. It's in the way now. So while she moves her huge basil plant, we are going to, you need salt, and it's just salt to taste. So I'm just gonna, just a Sprinkle little bit, it. just a little bit. There. Some black, crushed black pepper to taste. Everything's to I'm taste. I'm gonna do this, this black pepper and not the yolk. Just gives it a nice little taste. You don't need lots, you guys. You don't need no. lots, no. no. And with, with the basil plants too, I forgot to mention, make sure to remove the stem off the tip there. And then just some oregano. And now, Take your balsamic vinegar reduction, and actually I've got too much on my spoon here, and just sprinkle, like just, uh, you don't want too much, just to make it look pretty. That looks nice. Look how pretty, just mm -hmm. a little dab on each one. You don't want the vinegar to overpower all the fresh, even though I love balsamic vinegar. Me too. I love, love it. Me too. Oh you guys, this is starting to look delicious. I can't wait to dig into a few of these here. Let me just yeah, our guests a bit better more. be here soon. And, and this I'm is such a nice way to impress your guests also. And then lastly, olive oil. Olive oil. Yep. And just drizzle. And extra virgin olive oil. Very important extra virgin. Yep. Good quality just very, olive oil. Just a light drizzle on the very top. Yeah. 
And then while she's doing that, just a little more oregano now that we've got the olive oil and balsamic vinegar. So it sticks on the top there. I love this bottle because it has a, such a small mouth. So yeah. the drizzle is perfect. A little more. And let me hold this plate up to the camera here. There we go. Look at our delicious. Guys, look at how good this is. Isn't that amazing? Simple, easy, caprese skewers, caprese salad bites, whatever you want to call them. Perfect. Aren't they delicious? Perfect. Such a great, cute little appetizer. Yeah, so we hope you enjoyed our recipe. Thank you for watching. Simply, Simply Delish Duo. Duo.